In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to connect PlayStation 5 controller to PC Epic Games. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm gonna teach you what you can do to set up your DualSense controller to work with any games that you play through the Epic Games Launcher. As of today, the Epic Games Launcher does not offer native support for your PlayStation 5 controller. Of course, you should still try to see if it works natively, but assuming that you have tried previously and it didn't work, then, like I said, it ties back Back to the fact that unlike the Steam Launcher, the Epic Games Launcher lacks a lot of controller native support. So because of this, we need to use an external tool to set up the DualSense controller. So open up a web browser and look for DS4 Windows. You will can either look for this on Google or go over to ds4-windows.com. On this website, we will be able to download the tools that allow us to set up the DualSense controller. Of course, this also works with DualShock controllers if you want to give it a try, but regardless, all that you have to do is click download and then choose download once more. Download the latest version available of this application and drag it somewhere. Make sure that you extract extract the zip file. Now open up the ds4windows.exe file and you will have to install some drivers to begin with. Once you install those drivers by the pop-up that appears, you will be good to go to use this tool. Now let this run on the background, make sure that you don't close it after the initial setup. In here, click the option to start and if it detects that any DualShock or DualSense controllers are connected to your PC, you will be able to see them here. So make sure that you go through and you connect them either with a cable, so a wired connection or a wireless connection, whichever one you prefer. Once the controller appears here, which sadly I won't be able to show you in full on this video, you will be able to go over to profile, click new and then set up the controller. It is extremely simple and all that you have to do is edit every single button available or just leave it on default. Usually the default profile will be enough for you to play because it is set up for most games. Afterwards, open up any game that you Wish to play through Epic Games with your DualSense controller, and as long as you allow that to run on the background, you will be able to use your DualSense controller to play. Of course, you can also go into the options inside of any game and see if you yourself can configure it inside, and usually the options are going to be available. In some games, you might have to change the platform like Fortnite, where you have to change the buttons to PlayStation 5, and after you do, you will be good to go. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect PlayStation 5 controller to PC Epic Games. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.